you know, they've got a lot of dangerous players, but Ajo's the one guy that gets a little closer in that slot and uh, gets a lot of dangerous chances from that area. Got to eliminate him there. That was a good chance for Jordan Stahl. Now in front. Oh, what a save by Binnington on Stahl. Flashed out the right leg. A brilliant save by Binnington. On the net, but here's the battle in front of the net by Foss. Right on the tape to Stahl. And a better reaction save. You can see that pad of Binnington. You see the strap of it. The pad nearly... Blues have not scored a power play goal in the last two games. They have not gone three games with a power play goal all season. Thomas gets in. Good entry right there. Now sod for Tarasenko. Down low for Thomas. Backdoor feed. What a pass at Buchnevich. A power play goal when the Blues lead 1-0. Freely like this. Some pinpoint passing there. Sod, light touch of the stick to Tarasenko, down low to the goal line, and now you can see the wonderful pass by Thomas. I, I mean, just eyes in the side, in the back of his head, he feathers this over beautifully, Buchnevich slides in. Robert Thomas to specifically say about Mia Rizzo, who uh, is uh, really battling cancer, and she's hoping to get into Washington. Um, in for some, I mean, really some serious treatments. I asked her before the game, and, and he's like, that was, it's inspirational. Now it's Stahl, who's had a couple of great chances tonight for the Hurricanes. At the line for Burns. He comes in, Burns in on goal. Glove saved by Bennington. Wow. On Burns. Did he make that look easy? Paul finds him with a nice little pass, and he goes to the backhand, to the forehand. Now to Hahn for Chatfield. That's dumped in. Bennington can't knock it down. That's settled by Pareko. Sorry, John. That does change up their top six, though, when Pacioretty comes back. One of the most lethal wrist shots in the game. Here comes the birthday boy, Achari. And he scores! How about that? On your birthday, Achari, 2 nothing blows. Letty does a nice job of dissecting the neutral zone. Makes an excellent pass. I think Letty's game through the neutral zone has been phenomenal the last four or five games. And this one here, a tough one for the goalie. So the Hurricanes on the power play. Their power play ranked 26th in front. Pennington down, makes the save. It's like a jump ball there. Blues get it, and they fire it down the ice. Yeah, it burns at least 20 seconds as Burns gets back to center for Natchez. In on the wing. And now they go low. A couple of blues are there. Thomas with it. Puts it high. Knocked down by Burns. Here he comes. Shoots and he scores. Oh, and Burns from the deep slot. Blues look around. Wondering if they thought there might be goalie interference, Darren. Chen staying in the box. Let's take a closer look at the battle down below. The Blues have a chance to get it out. Burns keeps it in. Well, Svechikov right in front, I believe, is the player that maybe made contact. Let's see if he did. Yes, he did. I think the Blues might challenge this, Darren. He was bumped by Pareko a bit. A uh, slight bit. In front now, Foss there, so the power play goal at 5.24. And it's 2-1. Now Shea with it. Fires it, blocked by Achari. He was knocked down. Another shot, they score! And Martinuk, I believe, has tied the game at two. Blues frustrated with Achari being taken down. Justin Pierre, St. Pierre's looking at the bench right there. The Blues don't like it. Craig Berube's right there. Brady Shea's stick is right between his legs. And yeah, I mean, that is a break for the Carolina Hurricanes. Now the captain. Good pass back for Nick Letty. Off his skate, that is read well. And moved along by Natchez. Gets around O'Reilly. On the wing now for Jarvis. Shoots, he scores! What a shot by Jarvis. And three in a row by the Canes. To go from a 2-0 game to a 3-2 game. Natchez makes a great, oh, what a great move that is there through the neutral zone. Feeds it off to the side. And, you know, this shot on its own, let's just take a look if it's on end. Does it hit anything? Oh, yes, it does. It glanced right off the shaft of the stick. Thomas waiting. Out high for Krug. And then Tarasenko. Tarasenko gets it back. Goal line to Buchnevich for Krug. Right in, shoots. He scores! Krug, a power play goal! And this is the second unit comes out on the ice. They snap it around. And Tarasenko goal line down. And what a pass by Buchnevich. And I thought that when he released this puck, 
that he didn't get a lot on it. And and it looked to me like that was supposed to go high and it goes low, and the goaltender is not set for it. Let's just take a closer look. Yeah. I mean, looking by the follow through. They're winning a lot of board battles. And look at here they go again. Here comes O'Reilly back in. Now Levo back of the goal. Levo still looking for his first goal as a blue. It comes right in front in the blue paint, covered by Kokechkov. Power play goals in this game. Bennington sitting on 99 career wins. Oh, look out. Breko had to go through his legs. Bartnick races in, and he scores under the stick of Bennington, and Martinuk has made it 4-3. When the Hurricanes went on a three-game goal rampage there in that second period, that puck there, the flow is going one way. It doesn't get in deep. Martinuk takes it. Does it go off the... Yes, it does. It goes right off the stick blade of Letty as he's releasing it right there. And then underneath... Now Bennington is off. He gets to the bench for the extra attacker. Hurricanes play it around. Kept in by Buchnevich. And a drive. That was off traffic. Look out here. Stall to center. Empty net chance. And he scores. Jordan Stahl makes it 5-3. Gone off to the left after Buchnevich takes it in the, in the middle of the ice. So again, we talk about shots getting through and all Stahl does there is he lines up the two shin pads. He takes it right off the pads. By the Hurricanes. Goes win the faceoff. Kairou trying to spin out of the circle in front. And they score, O'Reilly on a great setup, and it's five to four. He hasn't been heavily tested. Cairo makes takes it on the backhand, and this is an excellent play by Jordan Cairo right here. And right away, watch Ryan O'Reilly. His eyes, as Stahl leaves his man and goes to the puck carrier, that leaves O'Reilly wide open, and he gets a lot on this one. 20 seconds left, and again the Blues keep it in there, and now Burns back of the goal, on the glass, and that goes all the way down, no icing, and the Hurricanes are going to get it, and Martinuk will get an easy hat-trick goal, his third tonight. And where did he come from way over there? So, on the right side, he cuts to the middle, and as soon as Burns gets that off the glass, he was gone. That's why I, I, I didn't spot him. I was actually hat trick for Jordan Martinuk. And it comes at 1951, and that's going to do it. Hurricanes tip it in. And Bennington rather casually kicks it away. So the Blues, after a great comeback win,